Tonight, Provo High School students, staff, and their families are likely feeling relief after a weapon seen in the hands of a student on campus turned out to be an airsoft gun. While no one was hurt, it was still a very serious incident. Fox 13 Spencer Joseph was the first reporter on scene and spoke with students about the experience. I'm just in a state of shock, like, like this never happened to me. A serious scare at Provo High School after a student is seen with a gun. Thankfully, it turned out to only be an airsoft gun, but police still responded in force. Anytime there's a weapon involved or an allegation of a weapon, we take it very seriously. Police confirming two students were in a fight outside the school. One of them had an airsoft gun. Nearby students thought it was real and rushed to tell teachers. Police quickly responded and apprehended the first student with the airsoft gun, then going room to room in the school to find the second. Everywhere was searched. Um, to ensure the safety. Both students involved were taken in for questioning. Fox 13 captured one person in the back of a Provo police car, with that car driving off after the all clear was given. But the experience shook students. I was inside walking outside. I saw a bunch of cop cars. I was like, what happened? I ran. I was with a girl at the time. No, let's run to the neighbor's nearest neighborhood. And I grabbed her. I ran to the neighbor nearest neighborhood. And then I just gave my mom a call, let her know what's happening. Other students saw the scene unfolding from the inside. And my class has windows where you can see outside through the school. This is Adrian Vasquez's view of the initial moments. As this was happening, he got a call from his friends in another classroom who witnessed the fight. And then apparently they saw somebody go to their truck and pull out um, a gun. <laughs> And then that's when they, that's when two of them, that's when my friends ran inside. Provo police and all the other agencies involved say the lockdown worked incredibly well. The students did an exemplary job and to have not one injured is definitely an accomplishment for the day. As did parents. You know, there were a number of parents who stopped and asked me, what do we do, what, what, what can I do? And a lot of times the parents have to, have to trust that those things are happening. So we appreciate that, that, that they trusted. Despite the all clear, the shock of this scare was still with every student and parent as they left for the day. It's really scary, like I'm shaking. Provo, it's very nice. Utah's very nice around here. And now just to see it happen here in Provo High School is just very shocking. Spencer Joseph, Fox 13 News, Utah.